Happy Hump Day, athletes. Hope your week is going well. Coach Autumn, Coach Scott coming to you live from the Impact Studios. Um, leg day, uh, lots of booty work, lots of good stuff um, as always. So hopefully uh, um, you were able to get through Monday's workout and, and rocked it, which I'm sure you did. So what we have today, um, a lot of um, single leg holds and split stances. So really trying to work um, each side of the body independently, but we also do have, we, we've combined them as far as the squats especially, uh, to be able to, to run through both legs. All right, so what we have, single high knees with a lift and chop. Uh, I would suggest a 10 pound sandbag on that. Um, You'll see me, I'm gonna use my joggers as an alternative for that. Um, suitcase split stance squat. There's a happy alliteration right there. Um, half kneel arc press. And I got a little uh, bump up, uh, advanced move if you wanna try it. We're gonna do a single arm thruster. So you're gonna need a kettlebell. Um, if you don't have a kettlebell, use a dumbbell. If you don't have a dumbbell, uh, here's your chance. If you have a plastic jug, the gallon uh, milk jug, fill it with water. That'll be seven pounds. Seven pounds better than nothing. Um, honestly, use whatever uh, of weight that you can hand, uh, that you use with your hands, easily use that. Uh, and then a single leg hold with a half arc press. So you can see what's going on. We're getting some arc presses, so we're getting some shoulder work, some upper body work. But we're doing them uh, in, a, in a situation where we need good hip stability and hip strength. Our um, finisher today is uh, our friend uh, Sally Up, Sally Down. I won't talk about that one yet, um, but you'll see it uh, on the post-workout. All right, so single high knee with a lift and chop. I'm not doing this with a 50. I don't really know who could do it with a 50. Um, but you guys are going to do it with your 10, probably a 15 pound, pound bag will work as well. You can use a towel. Anything to be able to set the shoulders and be able to create tension through the shoulders is what we're looking for. Alright, so the high knee with the lift and chop. What we're going to do is we're going to work one side at a time. Our lift and chop is at a 45 degree angle. And what we're gonna do is that we're gonna get into, we're gonna do a step back into a high knee and then do our lift and chop. There's our lift, there's our chop, and we get into our step back, lift, and chop. Lift and chop. You're gonna do one side first. Um, I would suggest, so we have a little bit more neutral handle feel like we have in our sandbags, not to be here, but let's get the palms facing each other. So there again, quick review, shoulders down and back, step, pulling this apart, up and hold. Work through that big toe, boom. One side, then the other. Um, suitcase split stance squat. Um, <laughs> We're going to be at weight during our workout, um, and these will feel a little bit better when we get into Sally up. So, suitcase, suitcase handle, same side. We're going to be here in our almost a lunge. Just a, it's a, it's a mini lunge. It's not a full lunge. So we're going to come from here and up. As we're going low, that sandbag really wants to pull us to the right side. Work through each of those toes. You remember, as always, your goal is seven to 10 reps when we're doing our training. And then switch to the other side. My suggestion as you go through these, work one side, one round, work the other side, the other round. That way you're not trying to think, well, what did I just do? Half kneel, arc, press. This is gonna be a full arc press. That is very 
uh, specific because we're going to do a half arc press here in a couple uh, couple minutes. So, take your bag, squeeze it like a big hoagie sandwich, elbows come down, work through the back toe, work through the front toe, and I want to make sure I'm doing this, yep, half kneel arc press right here, and up and over. This is the full press. Ribs are down. Hips are underneath this. Now, if you want a little spice to your life today and want a little extra challenge, you can use a, you know, you can probably go a little bit lighter. I'm going to try to get this with the, with the 50. So we're going to get this into our into our shoulder position for our arc press, elevate the heel, or excuse me, elevate the knee. That's spicy at 50, <laughs> believe me. But it's a little way to advance this move uh, to get out of the half kneel. Do the half kneel, that's where I want you, but if you want a little flavor, kick it up, elevate that knee. Um, Single arm thruster. So if you have that kettlebell, if you have that gallon of milk, um, I'm gonna grab a kettlebell. You can use a dumbbell as well. So you're gonna clean to the front rack. Squat, thrust. Back to, the, back to the front rack, uh, squat, thrust. There again, working one side, that right side versus the other. Um, now, single leg hold with a half arc press. So, very similar to the lift and chop. Very similar. However, we're not moving, we're not getting back into a step back. Wednesday's challenge, I think. Uh, all the days blur together, they all end in Y. The high knee holds, we're here, and then closing our eyes, really trying to get that good high knee and stability. Now, This is what we're gonna do. Take your sandbag. You're gonna hold your high knee, but we're only gonna go halfway up, up and back. So the weight opposite the knee that is being raised. So hold a high knee. Oh. See, when you, when you go with more weight than you should, that's why I should be actually doing this around 30 pounds. But I'm gonna get through this. I'm just gonna do that one, because <laughs> that was successful. So, there again, it's here, up, halfway, back over. Up, halfway, back over. If you have to touch, it's fine. Reset yourself, boom, and boom, seven to 10 reps. Those are your five, uh, stations for today. Our Sally Up, Sally Down. We're going to do an unweighted version of our split stance squat. So, obviously, Sally Up. So, this is our Sally Up position, whether we're on the left side or right side. So, Sally Up, Sally Down. Sally Up. Sally down. It's almost a lunge, but we're going more vertical. It's not a big, we're, this is a lunge, this is a split stance. This is split stance is where I wanna have you, then you're gonna squat. Think about a squat, we got the squats going right here. Squat, same motion. So, Sally down, Sally up, Sally down, Sally up. 
Uh, keep posting selfies, keep posting your workout videos. Love the feedback. Do them on the private page, do them on your own page. Um, still looking forward to that May 1st. Fingers crossed, keep good thoughts. Um, that's about all I have for today. Own every movement. You guys are doing well. Keep going, keep going. It's imperative. Um, on uh, behalf of Coach Autumn, myself, have a great Wednesday. Know your impact.